Yo, what's up family? Welcome back to the channel. So Focused Marketing and Promotions, Tech and Lifestyle channel. I'm your host, Mr. I'm So Focused. All right, so what we got today, we got another Goodwill haul, another Goodwill video, whatever you want to call it. Um, as you can see, we live in the rack. We in the garage. I just unloaded everything. Um, I didn't feel like bringing it all the way downstairs to the studio. So we're just going to do it live and direct from the garage. All right? Um, if y'all interested in these videos, let me know. I'll take y'all live with me, video camera style, GoPro style, inside the um, the Goodwill stores. This is the second Goodwill video. Um, this is the lifestyle tech and tech channel. So this is more of the lifestyle side. Um, if you're interested in doing this, it is what it is. You know, I'm telling you the prices that I'm going to get. You get the prices that you're going to get. Whatever you feel comfortable. I don't like to keep stuff too long because it takes up screen. Um, it takes up floor real estate, you know. So I got to store the stuff and all of that stuff. And I don't like doing that. I like to get them in and get them right back out. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully, preferably the same day or the next day. That's why I'm shooting these videos right after I get this stuff. So I could give you all the content and then I could post them and then they could go. All right, that's just my theory behind it. If I take too long to make the videos, everything start piling up, and that's no good. So it's going to be picking it up, video, selling it. That's it. All right, three steps. All right, so this is the second um, video of the Goodwill stuff. Like I said in the first video, go to the store, ask them the color of the day, go shop, get your stuff, post it, list it, do whatever you need to do. All right? If you're into that, if not, if you want the other side and you're just buying stuff because you want to save money, you want to go see what they got, you're going to use the stuff yourself, knock yourself out. You know, sometimes I'm not showing y'all everything on the, um, on the, uh, everything I got because sometimes I keep the stuff for myself. But most of the time I'm showing y'all every single thing because these are new videos and I want y'all to see, see how the process works. All right, enough of the talking, let's get into it. All right, first thing up, we got a big item. Y'all probably won't be able to see this too well, but whatever. We're going to make it work. This is a, a lug, a rolling luggage. It's by, most importantly, you know, it's op it opens up, obviously. You can see the brand name inside there, itluggage.com. I paid $19 for this. We're going to keep numbers whole. I'm going to say 20 bucks. All right. It's by this brand right here, It Luggage. Got your nice summer print on it. You know, people still traveling. You got your wheels on the bottom. Y'all can see that. So, spins around easily, side to side easily. All right, 20 bucks on that. I don't got the calculator with me, so we're doing whole numbers. We're keeping it simple. So, we're doing it old school, pen and paper. 20 bucks. Keep that in mind, all right? What I'm going to ask for this, I'm asking double. I'm going to try to make double my money off of that. I looked it up online. We could look it up also. I've never seen that print, but we're going to look it up also. We're going to do the research right now. Um, we're going to go to good old eBay. So we're going to go to eBay right there, eBay.com. And we're going to type in it, luggage. Um, and we're just going to look at some comps, comparisons, as I should say. All right, so... Rolling luggage, it luggage. You got one right there for 131. That don't got the print on it. Um, $79 rolling. Um, that's not that's a trolley case. Um, we got something close to that right there, but that's that's a smaller one, I believe. That's a yeah, that's a um, a carry on. All right, so we got another one. Let's see if we can find it. I always go to eBay because you might not, you know, find what you're looking for. So you just do comps. All right. We got a small one right here. It luggage. Um, London inspired. They asked 95 bucks for that. All right. Before I clicked on that one, I saw this one. You could compare it with that because I got a print on it. And they asked 75 bucks plus $22 for shipping and handling. All right. So I got a print on it. You know, sort of the same thing along the same lines. You know, I think that one might even be a little bit smaller. But like I said, I got that one for 20. I'm going to go for 40 to 60 on that. I'll probably just put 50 and see what people um see what people respond with. Another thing, another tip for y'all, always price high. 
You know, if you price high, you give the people the room to, you know, haggle you. All right, that's another little tip for y'all. You know, price it. If you really want 50, put 60. And when they, ah, oh, you got me. All right, you know what I'm saying? That's just a little tip. If you put 30, they're going to talk you down more than likely to 15. But if you put 40, you better yet, you have better chance. put 45, 50, you have a better chance of really getting to 40. You know? So always think about that when you are pricing these items. All right? So that's the It Luggage Suitcase. I'm going, I'm, I paid 20. I'm going to try to get, um, I'm going to try to get 40 off of it. All right, so we starting over 40 pen and paper style. So I'm gonna go with 40 off of that. All right, next up, we got two Wilson tennis rackets. All right, I'm gonna take this out. We're gonna put it on the floor so y'all can really see it. All right, these are the these are Wilson tennis rackets, titanium, the volcanic. Um, always look at the you know, the writing on it because it gives you a better, um, you know, way to look it up. So you got the Volcanic um, Frame Technology, Wilson and W and um, Iconic Signature in the middle. Then you got the Titanium. All right. Remember, people still playing outside sports right now, at least where I'm at. So these are, and I got the, um, the cases for it, which is good. People always want to make, make stuff feel like new. So, you got the Wilson number one in tennis. I got two of these. Better to buy them in pairs, you know, because you need two people to play tennis, right? It's obvious. So, this one is the same thing. All right. So, let's look it up real quick. Oh, check out the socks. You got the stay focused joints on. All right. Check those out real quick. Um, all right. So, we back on eBay, and we're going to type in Wilson, Wilson, I got the AC on, I don't know if y'all can hear that, if it's making too much noise, but it's hot as hell in the garage, so I got to keep it on, Wilson Volcanic, um, Titanium, Racket. All right, and then you just look them up. You see which one you got, and you see the prices. So this look like one right here. This is the one right here that we got. Boom, just like that. So this person is asking forty nine fifty dollars for one. All right, you see it. He asked him fifty dollars for one of these. All right. So what I'm doing, I'm gonna ask for what he asking. I'm going hundred dollars for both. All right. I spent five ninety nine each for those. I forgot to tell y'all that. All right, so I got um, I got let's say twelve dollars in it, and I'm gonna ask for a hundred dollars for both. All right, five ninety nine each. I spent for those. All right, I don't. Oh, there go the price right there, five ninety nine. Some of the sometimes the stickers come off, but when the stickers is on there, I'm showing y'all. I'm keeping it real with y'all. Five ninety nine. Y'all can see that. All right. So I'm gonna ask fifty bucks each for them, a hundred bucks. So I'm, I'm, I'm like I just told y'all, I'm pricing high. So if somebody comes through with seventy five, I only got twelve bucks into it. All right, these are real videos. This is real time. This is what I'm doing. I'm shooting these videos for y'all. You know, get yourself a nice little hustle. If we play tennis, you can rock them out yourself. Five ninety nine. You can't go wrong. Handles ain't that bad. Still got the Wilson branding on the bottom. All right, so a hundred bucks, five ninety nine. That flip is insane. All right, next up, keeping up, keeping with the tennis theme. I got these um, Trayton XL tennis balls. All right, Trayton XL tennis balls. There's four of them inside the pack. It's four of them inside the pack, and uh, one of them is um, used. So let me try to get this in, in um, screen sight for y'all. So you got three brand new, and then you got one that's used. All right? So let's look it up. 
good old eBay, and we're gonna see what they work. These are good tennis balls right here. So, um, good old eBay again. And we're gonna go Trayton, XL, tennis balls. All right, so you look them up, $47.99, $99.99, um, $40, bucks, $15, $15. Um, I got $2.99 into those. I spent $2.99 for those. I'll show you all the receipt at the end. So I got $2.99 into that. So what I might do, I might, another thing y'all could do is another tip for y'all, just bundle the stuff up. So I'll sell the tennis rackets, Plus the balls, a hundred bucks. So that way somebody could feel like they're getting an excellent deal. You know what I'm saying? But as we look, you know, you see the prices. They don't have a lot of them because it's an old style tennis ball. But if I was going to price it individually, I might just ask 10 bucks for it. You know what I'm saying? I just ask 10 bucks. But since um, I got the tennis rackets, I'm going to do a bundle deal. I just just came to me and I'm like, why not? So I'm a hundred dollars for the tennis rackets plus the balls and whoever rocking out, they go straight to the tennis court and they rock out. All right, remember that bundle deals, bundle deals. You get rid of stuff quicker and you get rid of stuff quicker and you could probably make more on the flip. All right, hundred dollars balls and tennis rackets. All right, let's keep it moving. All right, next up we got these tumblers right here. This one is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. It's a tumbler to keep, you know, for your kids or for yourself. You know, if you like oatmeal in the morning or whatever, you keep your oatmeal inside there. All right, right there. I spent 99 cent on this. See 99 cent all around it, 99 cent. Like I said, if you're not flipping stuff, you could, you could easily, you know, keep this for your kids. Keep it for yourself. This one is Transformers. You know, it keeps stuff warm and it keeps stuff cold. 99 cent. Clean. All right, so what I'm asking for for these, if I don't give them to my, to my, to my son, if he don't like them, I'm going to ask $5 each on these. So we're doing two for 10 special right here. All right? Two for 10. All right, two for 10 special right here. I spent a dollar each. All right, use your heads, man. Use your heads. And this is by the company. I'm going to rip this off real quick. This is by a good company, too. If you know, like, you know, thermostats and stuff like this, this is by the company Thermos. All right, you see it. 99 cent each turn into 10 bucks, $5 each. This is a bundle deal. I'm not selling one without the other because if I sell one without the other, it's going to be hard for me to sell a second one, just one for $5. So I give them both 10 bucks. All right, easy sell. All right, right out the door. So we're still keeping that tab on the pen and the paper. We have 40 for the suitcase, 100 for the bowls and the racket. And now we're going to do 10 for the, uh, the thermoses. All right, next up. We got a nice little mug right here for somebody getting married. Father, father of the bride, scan for payment. This right here is 59 cents. You see it? This right here, I'm asked five bucks for this mug. It's a novelty item. People love novelty items. Again, y'all got to move away from, if you're going to be doing this on the um, flipping side, you got to move away from stuff that you like. You got to start thinking outside the box. Start thinking about stuff that other people like. All right, you might not like it, that's fine. But somebody else is going to like this. And this is going to go for five bucks easy all day long. All right, it's a novelty item. You don't see it that often. So we're going five bucks on that. Next up, um, we got this doll right here. And I only bought it because, you know, it's another novelty item while sticking on novelty items. It's called Miss Perfect. She says what you want to hear. Try me. The but the batteries don't work, but I'm gonna put a battery in it before I sell it. She says 16 romantic phrases. 
That's her face right there. Got some defects right there, but I don't think that's going to matter. I'm going to show y'all exactly what this is worth in a minute. And that's the only reason why I bought it. You see the price right there that I spent for it? $4.99. Y'all see that? I'm not making these prices up. All right? So this is some of the phrases that she says. Let's not go to the mall today. I'd rather watch TV. I'd rather watch the game with you at home on TV. Why don't you invite your boys over tonight to play poker? I'll make them some sandwiches, serve you all night. Your warm towel will be ready for you as soon as you get out from the bubble bath. Honey, you are so smart. You should be running a, running a company. Baby, let's spend Christmas with your family again this year. You come from such a good stock. Your mom is perfect. You see what it is, you know? I, I like this. This is kind of like a funny little item. And I feel like there's somebody going to love this. You know? Don't worry. The lawn. Let me do it. I need the exercise. You're a genius with your hands. You can fix anything. You get it. Miss Perfect. All right? Miss Perfect. And on the back, you know, just some, some regular information. It takes uh, two AA batteries. Uh, yeah, I believe... Yeah, I think it's two AA batteries. All right? You see the battery right there. It don't say exactly which one, but it's two AA's. All right? She got the nice little robe on with the slippers. Let me show y'all how much this thing is worth real quick. Crazy. You're going to be surprised to see how much this is worth. So, remember. Remember the price I told y'all I spent on that? $4.99. So, I got five bucks into it. Um, five bu I got five bucks into it. I'm going to be asking, um, I got five bucks into it. All right. Check these prices out. The black lady, act the black lady one is actually worth more. So you got one for $12.50 right there. Plus you see the shipping on that. So he going to get whoever that seller is. He going to get like $27 out of it. Remember y'all, I spent four, $4.99 for it, five bucks. They got the black lady one again, 75 bucks. They got um, $45 for the one that I got right there. You see it. I don't make this stuff up, man. 45 bucks for free shipping. All right? I spent four. I got $5 into it. So I'm probably, this is what I'm going for, right? This is what I'm going to ask for right, now, for right here. 35 bucks. All right? That's the same one I got. Alright, I'm asking 35 bucks. Five bucks into it, I'm going to try to get 35 out of it. So we're going back to the pen and paper, 35. Remember y'all, if y'all flipping, this is it. If you're not flipping, you know what I'm saying? Just, you know, keep it. Keep it in the man cave. You know, keep it as a Christmas gift for somebody. You know? Alright, let's move on. Next up. We got these speakers right here. These speakers right here. The Eris 3.5 PreSonus um, Active Media Reference Speakers. These are like studio speakers. Put them on the floor real quick. So, the reason why I bought these... Oh, I forgot to tell y'all the price. Oh, my bad. Y'all all over the place. I'm, I'm moving y'all around. My bad, y'all. We live and direct. Y'all know how we do on this channel. No edits, no B-rolls. We get right into it. $7.99. Studio speakers. You know what I want to do with this right now while we got it open? While we got it out? I want to open it up. Even though I'm going to be selling it, I'm going to open them up. Because another thing I didn't tell y'all about, the, you got to make sure that the things either work or they're fully functioning. They have plugs in that store. You can plug them in. This was sealed shut, so I couldn't open it. But um, another, there's no returns in the Goodwill store. So once you buy this stuff, you can't take it back. That goes for clothing. That goes for book bags. It's a sanitary um, issue, I guess. They used to do it. They don't do it no more because of all of the stuff that's going on. So... That's another thing to look out for. It's absolutely no returns. You buy it, you, that's, it's yours. 
You know what I'm saying? So you got to just um, think about that while you're in these stores. All right? So I'm going to open this up real quick and see if um, everything is in here. So you get two studio monitors. You get two studio monitors. You know what? Check this out, y'all. Check this out. I'm live. I'm glad we do videos live and direct on this channel. Check this out. Live and direct, all right? I could have easily stopped the video right now and tell y'all, you know, um, that what was in the box and all of that. I could have kept going, showing y'all. Remember, this was $7.99, all right? So you see how that look, right? Watch this. This is the reason why I'm, thankfully, I just told y'all, you got to make sure what you're looking at is in the box. You know, you always take that chance. And there's no refunds on this. But I spent $7.99. All right? You see what that looked like? Check this out. This will, this what was in the box just now when I opened it. I can't hold everything in one hand, but. Logitech speaker system. For, for like a computer. You know? The good thing about this, and I always take the good stuff, you know, out of a bad situation, is that I need these. I got a nice little speaker set up, um, computer set up in the, in the studio. I'm going to use this. You got the power right there. You got your, um, you know, your, your volume controls right here. I can't hold it all, but it is what it is. Remember, I didn't get the studio monitors, but I got a nice little computer set up. You know, somebody switched it out. Or the people in the store just, you know, pulled the old bait and switch. But it is what it is, man. I got a speaker, um, computer set up. I'm going to use this up. I'm going to use this in the speaker set up downstairs. And, and we're going to rock out. But perfect. I'm glad that happened. Look at that. All right? $7.99 though. Even if I wanted to flip it. Even if I wanted to flip it. I could still get 30 bucks out of it. 25 i'll put it up for 30 somebody bring 15 they could take it but this right here i'm keeping all right this is gonna be my um speaker setup for my computer all right let's keep it moving this is why i like to do real videos with y'all because y'all got to see exactly what came out that box just to show y'all real quick that was in a box same box all right no bait and switch no stunts no nothing like that all right I can't take that back to the Goodwill store right now and be like, oh, y'all, y'all, you know, this will, they don't give no returns. Uh, absolutely, under no circumstances, no returns. So don't even play yourself. Don't go there. Don't be like, oh, this and that. You're not getting your money back. It's a big sign as soon as you walk in, fine print, no returns, absolutely no returns. Let's keep it moving. All right. Right here, we got a memory foam neck pillow, brand new, in the plastic. Pay $4.99 for that. This might be a keeper for when I'm chilling in the den. You know, chilling in the um in the den watching TV. I think I might keep this. I'm already in the profit on this whole thing. I already know that already. So, you know, I'm already in the profit. So it's not that's not the reason I'm keeping it. It's just that I know I could use this. So if not, you know, this is this would make a good pillow. For somebody for, you know, when they're riding on, getting on the plane. And I can easily get 10 bucks out of this. I've spent five. So on the pen and paper, we're going to put 10. And I'll just put it up. I'll post it. If it doesn't sell in a week or two, I'll keep it. All right? So this is 10 bucks right here. Memory foam neck pillow. All right? So we're going to go 10 on that. Go to the pen and paper. Write down 10. All right, next up. Um, we got some Nike, you know, warm-up pants, um, size, size extra large. I can't really see that, you know, like we're in the studio, y'all can see it better, but some Nike warm-up pants, you know what warm-up pants look like, all right? It is what it is. Nice little summer joints, ask 10 bucks for those, spent $5.99 for them, by the way. 
Show y'all on the receipt later. Not nothing too much to see there. Just some regular warm up pants. And then next up, got another clothing item. You got a um, Nike again. Nike official Nike hoodie. You can see the hood right there. You know, garage ain't the best place to show off clothes, but got the little nice, you know, stitching on it on the bottom. You got your black, you know, highlights on the bottom. All right, five ninety nine also. So we'll go ten bucks on that. Next up, uh, we got two more items, y'all. Two more items. Stick with me. We almost done. I don't like to hold y'all too long. Y'all know my videos. We get straight to the point. This right here, a nice little bear mug. It says "Love My Bear." It's like a man standing there holding his stomach. And then right inside, you can see it says, and it shows. That means like when you're at the end of your bear, obviously you get it. You love your bear. And then it shows, meaning that you got to the ending of it. All right. Another novelty item. Drop another jewel on y'all. People love novelty items, man. All right. And this right here, $199. So this right here. It's a nice little, you know, $7 piece right here. $8 piece. If you jump into $10, people are going to look at you crazy. So you keep those numbers um, keep those numbers down a little bit. Single digits, you know? You see that? Love my bear. Then this is backside on the back. No chips, no nothing. All right? And then you go and it shows. All right? $199 on that. So I'm going to ask you something bucks on that. Seven bucks. Next up, last item. Right here. So we got a a sunrise clock. Advance. So it wakes you wakes you up naturally with the gradual sunrise in the morning. Helps you wind down at night with the slowly fading sunset. Created by international experts in light therapy. Um, that's how it looks on the side. And this one is the model that has the sleep sounds. So this right here might be a keeper for me. All right, I like shit like this. So I might keep this. Not for the light, I just like the sleep sounds. All right, so this might be going in the bedroom. If it don't sell in a week or two, I'm about to, I'm gonna sell this for 20 bucks. And look what I spent on it. $7.99, y'all. You know what? That last box, fake this out. Let's go for another box. Let's see if we got jerked twice. All right. Let's see if we got jerked twice. Let's see what happens, y'all. These are live and direct videos. No B-rolls. No none of that. You know, um, I'll be right back. And then the camera go to another, um, another setting. And, you know, no, nah, none of that. We're going live and direct. Let's see if we got uh, jerked again. Ready? I'm opening the box right here. Y'all gonna see me open up the box. If I can ever get it out. Alright. That's the empty box right there. And this right here. Brand new in the box, y'all. Look at that. Clean. Uh, even if I ask 20 bucks for that, I could get 20 bucks all day for that. But I'm keeping this. If it got the nice sounds on it, I'm keeping this. This is going to be a keeper. All right? Clean. Clean. And this is like a glass. It got the bulb in it already. This is like a glass material right here. If I drop that live on camera, that would be some awesome content. But I'm not. Put that right on top of there like that. And then you rock out. Alright? Done. I might keep that. If not, I'm going to ask 20 bucks. So right now, for the profit margin, we're going to go for 20 bucks. That was the last item, y'all. Let's see what we got. Alright? I was keeping track. 
Excuse the handwriting. I got doctor's handwriting. All right? Don't judge me. So we got 40. Let's do it. Y'all ready? We got 40. 140. 150. 155. 100 and, um, 155. Then we got, um, we got 185, um, 190, 195, um, 205, 215, 235, and 235 plus the 7 is going to be 240, help me out y'all, 242, old school, 242 bucks y'all, that's what we got right now, alright, and that's all live, that's I'll go through it with y'all. That was the suitcase. That's for the tennis rackets and the balls. The ten dollars was the um was the um the the the, the pillow. The five dollars was the um no. The ten dollars was the tumblers. The five dollars. The ten dollars was the tumblers. Five dollars was the pillow. Thirty five was for the um, Miss Perfect doll. Ten dollars was for the um. Ten dollars was for the Nike sweater, the Nike pants. Um, the other ten dollars was for the father of the um, the father of the bride cup. Seven dollars was for the hold my beer cup, and twenty dollars is for the clock. Everything official, y'all. Two hundred and forty-two bucks. All right, potential flip. Now let's get to the best part: the receipt. So here's the receipt. It's not no BS, keeping it 100% funky with y'all. Goodwill store. You see that? Goodwill. And this is everything that I spent. $19.99. That was for the suitcase. $19.99 was for the suitcase. $7.99. Uh, one of the housewares. $11.99. You know, all of the stuff here. Everything. You see the prices. Total I spent at the store, $85.43. Got my change and I walked out of there. All right? And potential profit, again. So, spent 85 bucks. You see it? Potential profit, $242. Excuse the handwriting. But it's all it's it's all numbers at the end of the day, all right? Eighty five two forty two. All right? It is what it is at the end of the day. You want to see real numbers? Let's go to the calculator and let's see how much you know what the profit is. So go to the calculator. Two forty two minus eighty five. We'll go 86 to be um, just 86, and that's a potential profit on this box, on this haul, 156 bucks. Yeah, so it's real, y'all. I don't play games, man. We're not, you know, we're not, you know, B-rolls, no none of that. We jump right in, and like I said, these are my prices. You might make a little bit more. You might make a little bit less, depending on how long you want to keep this stuff around. Me, I'm not looking to keep this stuff around that long. Somebody brings me whatever right now, or... If you look in the bundle stuff, you put it all together in a bundle, take a picture of it, and ask for 120 bucks. You know, that's profit $40, but me, I think this is, I'm calling this stuff kind of stuff slow sales. I'd rather just hold it, and if I can't use it, like I said, some of the stuff I'm using, I'm using the clock, I'm going to use the speaker system, um, and the other stuff is smalls, you know, so stuff that I can just put on a rack and, you know, it's not taking... The biggest thing is that um, that suitcase. That takes up the most um, real estate on the floor. It is what it is. But I think that right there is going to sell quick. I'm going to that 60 bucks for that. So I think that, well, I put 40, but I'm going to put 60. Somebody bring 40, they could take it. All right? So that's going to be the most screen, uh, floor real estate. But it is what it is. I'm willing to deal with that. The rest of the stuff I'm either using or I'm going to fold it up and put it on the rack somewhere out the way. All right? If y'all interested... Yo, get into it, man. It's a good stuff to get into. It's good content for the channel. If not, you just save some money. That's how, at the end of the day, you either making it, saving it, or investing it. Pick your poison.
All right? Like I said at the end of every video, three things in life you got to remember. And keep in mind, these things are very important, at least to me. Trust God, love families. Sorry, I messed that up. Let's rewind that. Three things in life you got to keep in mind. Three things in life you got to remember. Three very important things. Trust God, love family, and stay focused. Until the next video, stay focused, y'all. The Socks.